as we come to you live from Red Bull Arena in Harrison, New Jersey, as the Red Bulls look to win their third straight home contest as they take on the top team in the league. Real Salt Lake. Mike Petke starting 11. Thierry Henry, Fabiana Spindle, the strike 10. Of the only change, as we told you, Roy Miller, back from the Gold Cup, is your starting left. Val Salt Lake, missing a slew of regulars to either international duty with the U.S. team or to injury. It is still a formidable 11 put out by Jason Christ. Jason Christ led the team to MLS Cup in 2009. Believes he has the right stuff to make another run at it this year, and we're underway in Harrison. Sebastian Velasquez plays it ahead to Olmes Garcia. That's the best payback for the earlier foul by Alvarez. Thierry Henry plays the perfect ball. And how in the world do you leave Tim Cahill unmarked? We talked about a back post ball. That's a good header with velocity. Nutmegs the goalkeeper. But Thierry Henry knows where he's looking to play it. Right at the edge of the six-yard box. Far post. Thierry locks it in, a spindle off, going up for that. Penalty! A penalty kick for New York is awarded in this 23rd minute. I think it was Mansali to drag down Brandon Barklage in the area. It's going to be a spindle off, stepping up to take it. Watch the contact right here. That's what the referee called. He had a good look at it. There's the little bit of a grab by Bansali. Now for a spindle against his former team. Chance for New York to take control of the match. A spindle makes it look easy. Dead center. 2 nothing New York. Talk about a dream start to the game. The first 24 minutes and a spindle, cool as a cucumber. Little bit of a hesitation, sends the goalkeeper. Look at the play that gave the penalty. And to be fair, I think that's a weak call. This will be either a support striker or a wide midfielder. Holgerson. Trying to defend Olmes Garcia, Marcus Holgerson, and yes, the penalty called against Marcus Holgerson, and this is the chance for RSL to get back in the match. Well, that's human nature, too. When you get a penalty call early in the game, it's questionable. Often, you've got to worry about one the other way. Let's take a closer look. I think that's a dive, actually, but Garcia gets the call. And questionable, the one that Red Bulls receive, so I have no problem with a makeup call, and that, to me, is what this looks like. Alvaro Sabaria. 2-1 is the scoreline now. Robles died left, the shot went to his right. Well, we talk about this sport, and sometimes it's unfair. You look at a dominating performance for 45 minutes, and this, from a mental component, the worst time to give up a goal. Tries to spring Roy Miller, but cleared away. Stepping up, Luis Gill for the takeaway. And now Garcia sends Gill on his way. On the counterattack, Real Salt Lake. Luis Gill cuts it back. Crosses up with Morales. This comes to the 18. Laid off, Sabaria! Yes, it's in! Tie game! He beats Luis Robles, and we are level at two. Uh, 
Well, as good as this game has been for New York Red Bulls, that's how bad this whole play was because it started with a giveaway of all people by Tim Cahill. And then the overlapping run to Gill and this one. That's one that Robles would love to have another whack at, but an opportunistic bounce right into the path. And now you have a 2-2 game, but it was the ball that was lost as Red Bulls were moving up that allowed that attack. And that's the Borchers who earned his paycheck tonight going over the top. So will there be late magic from either side? Deadlocked at two. Garcia springs Plata. Played across Samarillo. Shoots and scores the hat trick. Alvaro Samarillo has stunned Red Bull Arena. It's 3 2 RSL. I can't remember the last time I saw a game like this. They are going absolutely wild. Rail Salt Lake, and who can blame them? It's those players we talked about, Steve. Late in the game, Plata makes this one happen, and Sabaria, you can't hit a ball any better than this. Watch Sabaria, a cutback, and then a toe poke. That ball's curving away. Upper 90, far post, nothing Robles can do on this one, but it was Plata that made the play. New York at one point, firmly in control, up by two. Three unanswered by Real Salt Lake to seize the lead. Plata, midfield, stripped away, Alexander. Luya Dula. Gets his motor going, plays it out wide. A spindle that gets on this. Four into the attacking area for New York. Fabian, a spindle into the 18. Push down. Penalty. And the yellow card as well. Unbelievable. Absolutely incredible game. The nutmeg. Against his former team. Fabiana Spindola looks to level the match. And does. Second of the game. We're tied at three. a very well taken penalty kick. Hits side netting, goes to the keeper's right. Very well done by Espindola. This is the play that drew the contact. Mound, he's had a tough game. Gets nutmegged, initiates the contact. Absolutely, because that transition through the midfield with Luis Gill in the game, Plata in the game, that could be dangerous. Sam plays it across. Grab a boy. Kept it away from Henri. Look out, Garcia trying to beat Holgerson. Gomez Garcia moving forward. Gives it a go. Saved by Robles. My apologies. That was Roy Miller on the far side with service for New York. Take it here. Barklich for Sam. Barklitz curls one in. Yes! The finish! Dex McCoy! Incredible! Third goal of the year from the man out of North Carolina and Red Bull regains the lead with less than a minute to go.
loose to the 18, and Alave clears it away. Petrescu, the referee, looks at the watch. Throw in for RSL, no time to spare. Morales.